Uh, we have new video from another one of these school board meetings. This one took place yesterday. Why is it always Florida? This one was in Seminole County, Florida. I have two clips here to play for you. In this first clip, a guy who shows up says that vaccines are a deep state conspiracy to depopulate the world. And this is the most listen to this. The most fascinating element of this is this guy says you can't even learn this stuff from Fox News anymore. He is too radical for Fox News. Fox News isn't giving him what he wants anymore. He's telling you the truth. You won't get it on Fox News because Fox News and Hannity have been compromised. Let's listen together. Order. Allow the speaker to finish. Thank you. The deep state medical establishment wants all of us to be depopulated. I know you guys think that's a conspiracy theory, but it's not. It's a conspiracy fact. Imagine. They're all in cahoots with each other to depopulate us. They want us divided. They want all of us to fight each other so they can win. This is good. Now, what would be the put? Like, of course, this doesn't pass the sniff test, but what would be the point of a mass depopulation? Right. I mean, the, the centers of power, if ultimately money is their motivation, you get money from people who buy goods and services. At the end of the day, that's what it is. And that could be by health care services uh, or that could be by products or consume streaming or wh whatever it is. What on earth would cause the centers of power to want to depopulate anyway? Like it, it doesn't even pass the sniff test versus evil. Evil is not going to prevail. All you've done is awaken a sleeping giant here. Every parent here. The language is, of course, of delusions of grandeur and, and incredible self aggrandizement. It's freedom, except maybe some of them that are brainwashed by the deep state media. I used to watch Fox News deliberately. I'm a conservative. I won't even watch that now because did you did he need to tell us he's a conservative? But listen to what he says about Fox. Hannity, all the rest of them. are. Too Let me tell you who I do listen to, which are renowned doctors, Dr. Sherry Tenpenny, Dr. Okay. Chris Tenpenny is that complete and total lunatic who was talking about the vaccine magnetizing you and, and some other things. What do we do about this? Do the I'm all for public comment periods. School boards are unable to get anything done because of these comment periods and these outrageous conspiracy theorists that are showing up who tell us they'll they'll do Fox News is too is Fox, Fox News won't tell you the truth. They've been compromised, but ten penny will tell you the truth. And there's a mass depopulation plan. What are we do we need to end the public comment periods? One more clip from this same meeting. Here's a woman who went to the same Seminole County School Board meeting. And she talks about she hits all the she, she's doing ivermectin. She's bringing back Bill Gates. Um, it, it's unbelievable. It is so sad. Pro maskers are touting death rates in hospitals as excuses to mask kids. Have they looked into what's really causing these deaths? Hospital protocols. The crowd is cheering that what people are dying from isn't covid. It's hospital protocol. in hospitals, ivermectin, HCQ. Why? Because it's not accepted by the National Institute of Health. Why? Drugs, these drugs have been around for years and have been used worldwide. Why won't they use them? Here's the key. Now, Bye. remember, those things have been peer reviewed. There have been RCTs and they show no statistically significant effect on covid. The fact that a drug has been approved for something else doesn't tell us whether it's effective for covid. This is it's part of the, the disinformation that they rely on for the money. In fact, it's actually the opposite. They say th there's money. There's more money to be. You wouldn't make money using ivermectin or hydroxychloroquine. Actually, the reason, as we talked about this with Vincent Racaniello yesterday, the reason these drugs start to be tested is because they are so cheap and they're just sitting around and doctors say, I've got nothing else for it. Let me try it. It, it's it's the reverse causality of what these people are talking about. It is what we need to do. OK, and it's it's cheap. Ivermectin is cheap. Why doesn't it work? Wink, wink. Follow me now. No agencies like the CDC and the FDA do not work for the American taxpayers. They are nonprofit corporations that work for companies, politicians and individuals like Bill Gates for years. Ethics can make 
For years, ethic complaints have been lodged against these agencies for the cozy relationships between them and the companies they are supposed to regulate. So it's always some kind of conspiracy. So what do we do? Is it time to end the public comment periods? Is it time to what? What? I mean, I don't know what to do. My instinct is never to suppress speech. I'm all about public comment periods at city councils, school boards, etc. But this is a nationwide epidemic of these school board meetings just being taken over by these people. I don't know how it should be handled. Let me know what you think. You can find me on Twitter at D Pacman. One of our sponsors is Sheath Underwear. It's summer right now in the northern hemisphere. It's hot. It's humid. Many of the men in my audience know about the discomfort that can come with this with traditional underwear, the sweating, the chafing, the sticking, not fun. And that's what sheath underwear has solved. Sheath has designed men's boxer briefs with multiple ergonomic compartments built into the front of the underwear, which keeps everything separate, dry, cool and comfortable all day long. Sheath has re-released two limited edition styles, flower of life with a stylish flower pattern and bold geometric waistband. The other limited edition style is the mesh airflow, especially designed to be lightweight and promote extra coolness and breathability. Give sheath underwear a try. I've had a great experience with it. I think you will, too. You can find the link underneath this video and don't forget to use promo code Pacman for 20 percent off.